Oh no, she's under the sink and she got our pills. Across the United States, around 800,000 kids are rushed to the emergency room each year because of accidental poisonings. Of these, around 30 children will die, according to the Consumer Product Safety Commission. About 165 young kids every day, or roughly four school busloads of children, are seen in emergency rooms after getting into medications in the U.S. 95% of medication-related ER visits among children under the age of five are due to a child ingesting medication while unsupervised. 60,000 young children are treated in the ER due to accidental unsupervised medication ingestions each year. 56 children ages 14 and under die each year from in unintentional medication overdoses. Hospital admissions from unintentional medication overdoses in children under age 6 have increased from 36 percent, have increased 36 percent from 2001 to 2008. Oh no, she got in my purse and got all my pills. There are three things you need to know about medication safety and child safety. The first thing is to keep things out of reach. This means keep, keep things out of sight, out of mind, so the child does not get to it. Never let, never let the child see you put things away because they may be tempted to go get a ladder, step stool, and go find it. Never leave meds unattended or alone, if, especially if they're in use. Do not refer to them as candy because that's the main turn off for kids. They think it's candy. As far as pill bottle caps, after taking your medication, make sure that they are secure, that they're not open, they're properly secured. Do not let the child see you undo the bottle cap because they may be tempted to do that because of imitation. Make sure you have child proof and not child resistant because child resistance are very different than child proof. And as far as locks, make sure the locks are properly attached. Don't let the child see you do the locks because they may try to undo the locks. And there are many types of locks and they're very inexpensive. Oh no, I think she ate some of these pills. I need the poison control hotline number. I wish I had it on my refrigerator. Now that you know how to prevent an accident or overdose, do you know exactly what to do in case, a rare, in case of a rare occasion that it happens? First, you want to put the Poison Control Center's number on or by your phone, and this should be in every house that your child visits. And if you think there was an overdose, you want to act fast. Don't wait to see what happens. Call the control, Poison Control Center immediately, and that number is 1-800-222-1222. Quick action could save a life. It could save your child. And that number again is 1-800-222-1212.